and welcome back to Honestly Onya. So today you're gonna get a little song, but I am here with a new haul, shiny haul, all about the skincare. While pottering about Ubud, discovered this place. Well, actually, it was recommended to me, and I went looking for it specifically. It's Sensatia Botanicals. Look at the little bag. Um, and it's all about natural products and all that kind of good stuff. Even the bag is biodegradable. It's one of those rubbery feeling things. And I may have gone slightly mental. I went in for a cleanser and I came out with quite a few items. Yep, had to happen. I haven't bought any beauty products since I've been here really, so had to happen at some point. First up, the cleanser that I needed to get. My skin has been particularly loving the cleanser I've been using. I will do a review on that when I'm back in England. So I decided to get myself a new cleanser. This is the green tea and tamarind facial cleanser and it contains active botanicals of green tea, starfruit and tamarind and it's aimed to help disturbed epidermis. I do love help disturbed epidermis, don't know why I love that. Um, it is all natural products and good things and it is soap free. So you just wet your face and then you apply it circular motions as you would and then follow up with your toner and moisturizer. So this smells divine. I decided to go with something aiming at the disturbed epidermis rather than acne prone because my skin isn't generally acne prone and I didn't want something too astringent on my skin and my skin is just a wee bit disturbed at the minute. It needs more love people, it needs more love. So really excited to try that. It does come in a nice box. I've just been unboxing things and you know, carrying on regardless. While we are on the face, I got this charcoal mask because the mask I brought with me, I used it and I realized I needed more charcoal masks in my life. This is the Acne Clarifying Charcoal Mask. I will be using it tonight now I've done this video. Um, and it's just enriched facial mask for clearer skin. Um, a vibrant, refreshing and earthy mask designed to stimulate, clarify, minimize and reduce acne by drawing toxins and dead skin from the surface of the face. There you go. So looking forward to using this later. Cannot wait. It is just a normal uh, charcoal mask. Did I need to close again? Um, so yeah, looking forward to trying that later. All of these came to, so it'd be 180 IDR, so 180 Rupaya, or however you like to say that. So 180,000, I should say. 100 is about six pounds, so under 12 pounds. Each of these things were all under 12 pounds. Together it made a lot, anyway. Moving swiftly on, we'll go on to body care. Whoop whoop. I decided to go for this Seaside Citrus Body Wash. It contains grapefruit, lavender, and rosemary leaf. It smells like the sea. It is just a really nice, it does remind me of the seaside. It's quite citrus -free, citrusy, very fresh, but has a sort of salty feel to it. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Really, really like this. Cannot wait to try it later. I've been waiting to try everything the blogger had to use you know how to do the video before I used anything then we also we me also bought a vanilla and mandarin body milk I decided to go with the body milk rather than a sort of moisturizer you know a heavy duty one like a cream because this climate my skin I have a bit of a heat rush going on so I need something a bit lighter on my skin this contains mandarin vanilla lemon myr myrtle um, and it's smooth and creamy, refreshing and earthy aloe based moisturizer, aloe based. There's a lot of aloe based products here. So that's quite a soothing thing. Looking forward to trying this. I'm gonna have a shower after my yoga this evening and just cover myself in this stuff. Might help calm my skin a bit more. I've been covering it in aloe vera. Something I'm dying to use, but I will have to wait now. It's the coffee and cacao brown sugar scrub. Now this one I've already opened properly. Smells so good. Quite a strong coffee undertone to it, but that nice sort of sweet, dark chocolatey scent over the top. Really, really good. Really looking forward to trying this. This is the smaller of the sizes. You can get a bigger tub than this. Cannot wait to use it. Again, I'm gonna wait for this heat rash to go down before I use it, just in case I aggravate the rash anymore. Um, and lastly, which is odd because it seems like there's lots. I got an aromatic bath kit. So it comes in this little box. However, I've been taking photos outside and it has been raining, so the box is a little bit damp. 
but you get four different products in it and I fell in love with the smell of this and it's not something Simon would really enjoy, it's quite sweet. So I got myself a little kit for when I go back to England to enjoy. And you get, it's a Sweet Ambrosia shampoo, conditioner, body wash and body lotion. And it contains sweet orange peel, grapefruit and geranium. So it is quite sweet, but it's not sickly. It's really, really nice. So cannot wait to try that. And it comes with just smaller sizes. They're all 60 mil. So I cannot wait to get using these later. So that is it for the skincare haul. Um, I do have, like I said, fashion products and stuff coming up and some lifestyle-y things that I may have got as well. Yeah, I got a bit excited. So I will be doing those in a separate video because they're all gonna be a bit long. Thanks a million for watching. If you have any questions about any of the products, let me know. I will be doing reviews on them all. I didn't go full on and get loads of Asian skincare like the ones you would see. I kind of wanted something a bit more natural because my skin prefers natural products a bit more. So aiming towards that. Like I said, any questions, let me know. In the meantime, thanks a million for watching. Please like, please subscribe, please tell all of your friends and I will see you in the next video. Bye.